Hey everyone, so the other day I did a video about poop and pooping. With that, it made me think of about digestion a little bit more and drinking water. You really want to be drinking water throughout the day. Uh, it's just in general, it keeps your body hydrated, but you don't want to really be drinking water with your foods, if you can kind of try to work on that. So what you want to do is you want to be drinking before or drinking after, but try to cut out that window of right when you're eating. Because what you want to do is when you eat food and you take that down into your digestion and everything and you have your stomach acids, you don't want to necessarily water that all down. You want to have you know, all of everything in your stomach be able to break that down, work on those foods and distribute you know, nutrients throughout your body. So you just don't want to just keep trying to flush everything down. But with that said, you do want to have a high, you know, fairly high water consumption throughout the day. But if you're also eating better and you're eating more fruits and vegetables, remember fruits and vegetables and a lot of those foods have a high water content as well too. Somebody who is eating a, a, a worse diet that uh, they might be drinking more fluids than you, but you might be getting the, the close to the same water content if you're eating real juicy, you know, fruits and vegetables because of that water content. People are going back and forth between how just how much water you should take in for the day. So I don't really go off a of specific ounces or per body weight or anything like that because it really comes down to what else you're eating, like I mentioned with you know uh, fruits and vegetables and their water content. But what I could tell you is for your urine, your urine should not be dark yellow and it should not be real stinky. It should be fairly clear or pretty clear. That's a pretty good indication that uh, you're pretty hydrated. So I know if, um, say, somebody takes a B12 uh, vitamin or has a lot of B12 and sometimes that goes through you, it looks like that nuclear yellow and that's just kind of passing through. Some vitamins that in your system or that you take in during the day are water soluble and some of them are fat soluble. So just in general as a, you know, kind of a theory, your, your pee in general should be kind of clear. And you should be going fairly frequently throughout the day. If you're only going pee, you know, once every few hours, then, you know, you probably want to step up your water. And then of course, you know, take into consideration if you are not going to be able to use the restroom for a while, you know, or if you're on a flight or on a long drive or something, obviously, you know, you probably won't want to be pounded on the water that time. But just in general, you know, you should be uh, sipping on water. If water is a little bit too boring for you, um, try and put in a little bit of lemon juice or squeeze in some lemon. And lemon water is really good for you for a few different reasons, but it also gives a little bit different of a flavor. And if the water doesn't taste that great or you're traveling and the, the water isn't real uh, clean, it's not going to purify the water but it'll help it taste a little bit better and the other thing too and I forgot to mention this this was actually the first thing that I wanted to talk about but I guess I don't think uh, I said it chew your food thoroughly take smaller bites and eat slower and in, with that too and I know people get busy and they get on the run and they get on the go and you're running and you're eating and you're driving and you're eating and you're standing up and you're eating but you really want to try to set aside some time okay you want to sit down you want to relax you want to chew your food take smaller bites and eat slower and that is all ideal for digestion because as soon as it goes in your mouth you know reactions start to happen you start to chew down the food starts to break it up nutrients start to you know get absorbed and you know you want that to be able to go down you want your system to work easier so the more that you can help out your digestion system by eating slow chewing your food it's going to help you out and help out your system it's going to be able to break it down easier you're going to get more nutrients and vitamins out of your food so try to do that and also when we're stressed you really need to bring down that stress when you're stressed and you're in a rush and you're in a hurry your digestion system, your, your whole system is just going to tighten up and it's not going to work efficiently. So try to, you know, set aside some time to eat properly, eat well, and lower that stress and it's going to be better, better digestion, it's going to be better for you, you're going to absorb more nutrients, and it's going to just uh, be better for you in general. So anyways, um, I think that's all the points that I wanted to go over. If I forget something, I'll put it down in the box below. 
Um, and as always, uh, any comments or questions, put them in the box below. I'll uh, get to it when I get a chance. And I hope you guys are having a good day. And uh, follow me on uh, Instagram and Twitter, and I have Facebook. And that's all in the link, uh, or they're all linked in at the bottom of the, uh, the box here, in the description box. So I'll talk with you later. Bye.